Hi, everybody. Welcome to Algebra Talks. Hi, Igor. Hi. You're the head of the Professional Bachelor Study Program in Game Development. Can you tell us a little bit more about the program? So why are there four and not the three usual years for this program? After five years experience with master's program regarding game development, we decided to expand on BA level as well. Um, that said, we came to realization that four-year program would benefit our students extremely more regarding our goal to provide well-rounded education in the field. Uh, our program is mainly anchored around programming classes and skills, but expands in the area of game design, basics of production skills, basics of 2D and 3D art, and the visual effects as well, as a good starting knowledge in business and marketing aspects of game development. What inspired Algebra to offer a bachelor program in game development? And what unique features does it offer comparing to other programs? Well, basically, as I mentioned, uh, we have that um, MA experience uh, and we saw the need to expand from that, especially in regard to the fact that our part of Europe lacks BA level of focused education regarding game development. Uh, we have a larger picture in mind, so four years BA was a logical step in that direction. And that said, uh, unique features we aim to provide our ability for our students to go in IT sector if they choose so, and a bit wider base of classes that will enable our students to excel in teamwork, um, which is a base uh, on the fact that they will encounter most, if not all, roles in production uh, or of creating a video game. Uh, in addition, our students will be able to start a team or a project of their own and not necessarily be able uh, to only work as an employee in existing studios. As you mentioned, game development is a wide area. So who is this program for? Um, can you tell me a bit more about the curriculum for this bachelor program in game development? Yes, uh, as I mentioned, we have around 60 to 70 percent of classes focused on programming skills and knowledge, while other 30 percent is dispersed on design, narrative, art, uh, visual effects, marketing and business areas of game development. Um, the crown jewel of our program is three semestral class called Team Project uh, that will have our students uh, teams create a vertical slice and a full documentation for their own game and they will be able to present that project to investors and publishers. Uh, they will, of course, uh, have a full mentorship from various areas of game development during that process and all in all our students will have ample possibilities to decide where to specialize and why. Um, our primary task is to find and grow their inner spark that is already there when they enlist here. What types of courses will students take as part of this program and what skills or knowledge will they gain from these courses? Um, as I mentioned, uh, focus is on strong programming fundamentals with possibilities to understand or further develop in areas of game design or production. Uh, art classes are also present and are also a possibility if someone finds themselves in that area, but we mostly aim to introduce it as an extra knowledge and understanding for previously mentioned areas. Uh, main skills we are focused on, focusing on are creativity and problem solving. Uh, we aim to equip our students with ability for them to create and adapt to all possible situation projects and development teams in this area of game development. How does your program balance theory and practice in game development? Uh, and what opportunities do students have to gain hands-on experience in the industry? Um, the balance is a fundament of our idea for this study, uh, as we believe no other way to teach game development can be better than that. Uh, theory is a must-have, uh, first step definitely, but implementation is as important if not even more. How do we implement that? Well, in a few ways. Uh, first one is that our teaching staff is mostly coming from the industry. Uh, they are people that actually make games or were making games for a number of years. Uh, given that fact, most of our exams and homeworks are project-based. Uh, we give you the tools and it's up to you to use them and earn the grades. And finally, we are planning to have practice and internships in our final year based uh, with our partner companies in game development who are very dynamic and willing to add their knowledge to our experience, to our BA. Uh, all in all, we hope to create the best possible future employees uh, for them and they are ready to help us. 
How does this program prepare students for future careers in the game development industry? And what jobs will they be qualified for upon graduation? Uh, as we see, it, there are three major ways. Uh, first one being project-based exams that mimic real issues and process of developing a video game. Uh, second is that team project that I was talking about previously, where our students create their first fully fully rounded projects and the final one is practice and internship in game development company of their choosing. Uh, their primary job opportunities will rise from previously mentioned aspects but we also uh, host uh, various events that will enable our students to present themselves to various companies. Um, such events are like Global Game Jam, Career Days and some additional things that we are going to plan in the future. How does this program stay up to date with the latest trends and technologies in the game development industry? And what steps does the faculty and the staff take in order to ensure that the students are uh, receiving a cutting edge education? Uh, well, first and foremost method is and will be our continuous cooperation with the local industry and hopefully even wider one. Uh, that being said, our mentors and lecturers will often come directly from the industry and will transfer their knowledge and experience directly to classes. Uh, I myself plan not to leave practical work in development completely because I believe that most of the staff here must be partially in the industry and partially in education as this whole BA uh, should and will be. Uh, we all must continually grow uh, as individuals from professors to the students up to the whole program and the whole ecosystem on algebra that surrounds it. Thank you Igor. See you at Algebra in Zagreb.